Hey, what's up, squad? It's the boy from Next Time. Back with another video. So in today's video, as you guys are from the title, I'm basically just gonna be doing a curly hair routine and updated one because the last time I did one was last year, and I've kind of updated it a lot more, so I need better results and whatnot. So I'm just gonna take you guys into the whole process right now. Before I start the video, I always say this: make sure you subscribe if you haven't already, like the video, and turn on post notifications so you never miss a video. Um, right now I'm trying to have 200 subscribers before the end of December, that's a fairly realistic goal. Um, so I'm going to be uploading a lot more consistently this whole December. So yeah, let's get right into the video. Alright guys, so first thing um, you're going to do is you know, shampoo your hair, wash it obviously. Um, I haven't shampooed my hair in a minute, it depends on when's the last time you shampooed your hair. If you just did it like the night, the day before or the day before that, then you don't have to do this process. But me personally, I haven't done it in three to four days, so I'm gonna do it right now. Alright guys, as you guys can see, I just got done washing my hair. Um, so I thought that the shower head carry all down lower than that, but it couldn't, so I kind of had to do it fast or I'm about to get water everywhere. But yeah, that was step one. You don't always have to do it. Just, if you don't do a shampoo um, part, then you just gotta get your hair wet before you start. But my hair's already wet because I just washed it. Next thing you're gonna need to do is you're gonna need to get like one of these type of combs that have this type of ending and some tiny rubber bands like this. So what I'm gonna do is try to part my hair. I'm not really good at this, but I'm only leaving it in for a few minutes anyways. So you're gonna part your hair and then you need to get two rubber bands, as you guys can see right here. Part and put one on this side, put one on this side. All right guys, I know I just said you need to part both sides, but you really don't have to. You just gotta make sure at least one side's parted. So basically for this next part, you gotta shake your hair to like get the excess water out. Um, and then you're gonna put in the can too, right here. You need like, like this much for one side, depending on how long your hair is. And then you just basically gotta run, run your hands through it like this, and just keep doing that. And like finger, like I was just doing, like finger pick your hair. Don't actually use a full on pick unless your hair is like nappy nappy. Just do this. And then keep running it through and finger picking it. So my curly hair routine before, I would just do this and like do that all around it with the curling cream. But it's, it's a lot better to do it like this because it just spreads it around more and like side the roots and whatever. So right now we're done with that part. Next, you're gonna need your eco gel and you're gonna put like a decent amount of this in, like a finger full, I guess. Like this much of it in. And you don't gotta do the whole parting with your hair or anything because this isn't really that important. Just gives it the extra shine and it holds it in. And then next, if you have a spray bottle, uh, do it with a spray bottle, but I don't got no spray bottle. So just get some water from your sink. Get like close to a handful and then just sprinkle it all around your hair. This is pretty much the finished product. Um, I'm gonna go on to like the next part of the video and show you guys what it looks like all around. Um, and if you need to put more or less of the Cantu and Eco Gel in your hair, then do that. This is just my personal preference on how much I put my hair and what all I do. So yeah guys, that was the video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you subscribe if you haven't already. Like the video and turn on post notifications so you never miss the video. I know that video was a little short. I, a lot of my videos are a lot shorter than they usually are, but it's just because I'm getting like the short videos out of the way first and then doing the longer videos like down the line. So that's why that video is short. But yeah, peace.